Hey guys, it's Drew here. I wanted to talk a little bit about this lock that I've been using. This is from Bar Locker, and it fits right inside your handlebar. It's a cable lock, cable combination lock, and it's really good for just quick stops, but I've been using it in tandem with my other bike locks as well, just to have a more secure uh, you know, approach to not getting my bike stolen when I'm going into different thrift shops and uh, just different places around where I live. So this is a combination lock and I will show you later in this video how to set your own combination because when you receive it it will be all set to zero so you'll definitely want to change that. But yes this cable lock fits right in your handlebar and it fits in most handlebars but not all so you want to look out for that on the package. This that you just saw was a bar end and it's actually to place on the handlebar that you're not using the lock in. This handlebar is my original handlebar on this fixed gear style bike. It is not only a little too short for the cable lock but it's also a little small in diameter to fit the cable lock end. On the package it shows you which handlebars it fits and which handlebars it doesn't. It does fit most, so just keep that in mind whenever you're going to make your purchase. I will show you here exactly how it doesn't fit in my fixed gear handlebar. The end won't fit as it's a little too small in diameter, my handlebar, and it sticks out the end. This shouldn't be the case for you as this handlebar on my fixed gear bike was a little small. So if you have two locks, you can actually use them in tandem by locking them together and you'll be able to fit around almost any fence pole or bike lock setup. Again, this cable lock is really strong, and it was tested up to, I believe, 500 pounds. So I will show you now how to set your combination. There will be a little hole to fit a Allen key. It should be the smallest size on most Allen key tools. All you'll need to do is take out that screw and the end will come off. Then all you have to do is take off the combination rings. And then place them back on to the set combination that you would like. by repeating the first steps, putting your screw back in, you're all set. So this will be part one review of this bike lock, and I will link down below where you can get one yourself and try them out. This is the perfect lock to have stashed in your handlebar, and you'll never forget your lock again.